I am Gabriel, the bug boy, and we're going to be learning about Eastern Yellow Jackets today. Okay, show me, uh, let's take a look at the, the nest, because you were explaining so, the nest to me. Yeah, so this is a Eastern Yellow Jacket nest. As you can see, it's built layer by layer, but normal paper wasps, they build one layer, and they also encase it with more paper over here. Interesting. Now, what is the difference between a wasp and a bee, typically? So, wasps feed on other insects, making them predatory. But bees feed on nectar, which makes them pollinators. Got it. Now, what's the difference between a bee stinger and a wasp stinger? So, a bee, when it stings, it can only sting once because it rips out its organs. But uh, wasps, they can sting as many times as they want because it isn't barbed, so it won't pull out their organs. Now, how long does this type of wasp live? It lives about 12 to 25 days. Got it. And what's the name of this type of wasp again? Uh, Eastern Yellow Jacket. Now, I noticed over here, can you explain why... Are these the Eastern Yellow Jackets here? A yes. type of them? Okay. Now... They do look like little bees. Now, why is this one here it looks like it's underground, but this one looks like it's on a tree? Can you explain to me? Um, they can build their nests in several different places. Okay. So, this one is probably in the air on a tree because that was more suitable. Okay. For where they were. Then, like, if the ground wasn't uh, built well enough for their underground, they would build it up here. So explain what is this I'm looking at here. This is underground? This is an underground yellow jacket nest and this is an arboreal one over here. And they almost look like little bees, don't they? Like if I were to see that, that almost could be confusing for a bee. They're yellow and black, right? Yep. Do people ever confuse them for bees? A lot. Really? Okay. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful. And the name of this insect again is? Uh, Eastern yellow jacket.